As always, there is nothing to do on Saturdays. But, good news is, is that I have hung out with a bunch of people recently. So, I can get some shrine resets on some of them. Let's start off with... So, I can hang out with Akihiko and, and it'll rank up for sure. Junpin, Yukari might not. Kodomaru and Ken probably will. So, I'm going to go with... Let's go with Junpei first since he's at 8. I'll do that. There we go. Hi, how was your day? Not bad. Hopefully I made the right choice. Kodomaru, please rank up. Yes, you will. Excellent. Let us partake. He's nuzzling you contently. No, he's not gonna rank up. Oh no, he will rank up. Yes! Are you playing with FemC? Good for you. Fuka arrived. Kodomaru is wagging his tail happily. Good boy. She's petting Kodomaru. Hey, FemC. I wonder, if we're okay as replacements for that priest, the reason why Kodo-chan always walks the same path and goes to the shrine, it's because he can't let go of that priest, right? So, do you think Kodo-chan is still feeling lonely? It might be faster if we just ask Aigis to interpret for us, but I'm a little scared to get a straight answer. He's looking up at you quietly. Are we good replacements? He's leaning towards you. You hug his warm body. Aw oh, man. He smells like a sunny day. Koro-chan looks so content. He must really like you, Femsi. Arf! Feel as though you can directly understand his feelings. You should try telling Fuka what Kodomaru wishes to say. Hmm? What is it? The way he thinks of us is... We're friends. He's wagging his tail. I see. I see. That's right. I kept saying that Kodo-chan is a part of us, but deep down I may have been thinking of him as a pet. He has so many memories of his own too. I'm sorry, Kodo-chan. He licked Fuka's hand. What a sweet dog. Hey, FMC. Let's make sure to stay with him for that priest too. Let's go on living together with him. He's running in circles as if he's happy. You sense his feelings. Oh man. I want to stop the recording right now and go go uh, give my dog a hug too. But I, uh, I kind of do it every time I see him. It's like a Pokemon encounter, you know? If, I, if I'm walking around the house and I see him, I just instantly tackle him. Kodo-chan, are you hungry? Want me to make you something? He's cowering in fear. You, <laughs> you comforted Kodomaru and convinced Fuka that Kodomaru wasn't hungry. It's getting late. Oh my god, even the dog knows that Fuka can't cook. I mean, she did get better, canonically, at the end of her social link. She is canonically not terrible. Who is it? And why do you have to... Get the fuck out of my face. I'm sorry, Yukari. Well, I don't need to, and on top of that, until I finish Akinati's link, I don't want to. But uh, we will, though, after. Don't worry. Alright, let's do this. Head to the shrine. Here we are. How many days do we have left? Half moon. So we have like, what, a week left? Whoa, whoa, what am I doing? Muscle memories taking over my body, oh my god. Hey, how do you feel about a pink alligator? Sounds wonderful. I thought so too. I knew you'd understand. He seems pleased. See, it's the main character of a story that I'm writing. He was born in the calm forest of green, but he turned out to be pink. He's so visible that he can't hunt for food easily, so he's always especially hungry. The other animals dislike him and consider his coloration disgusting, almost like he's cursed. So he started living alone, but then he made a friend. His friend was a bird, but a bird that was unable to fly. 
so the bird would stand on the pink alligator's back and practice its flying. It's embarrassing to talk about, but anyways, how does the story sound to you? Sounds interesting. It's an, uh, it's a representation of his life. I've never written a story before, and I'm afraid of, I'm kind of afraid it's going to suck, but I'm writing it for myself, so that's what matters. Maybe I'll be able to show you the entire novel someday. He seems content. I started thinking about it the other day, actually. I wanted to write an upbeat story of my own to cheer me up. Maybe if I can find some meaning to life, I can put that in my story. When I write, I can see you're in my mind. It seems as if you're telling me not to die just yet. He smiled weakly. Revelation is stronger. Glad to hear it. Rank 6. The wind is going to start blowing soon. I can feel these kinds of things now. I hope I have enough time. Let's go home. We can talk again some other time. The winds are blowing. What you, what you talking about? Greetings. The full moon will be here soon. I'm prepared to go to Tartarus at any time. Kodomato seems to be ready as well. Is that so? Now, now he just wants to go out for... He, he needs to pee. Someone needs to let him out. And it's going to be me. No! No! Why? Alright, let's go, I guess. I'm, I'm sacrificing watching this episode of uh, Phoenix Rangers so I can take uh, my dog out. It seems Kodomaru-san enjoys walking with you. Fuka-san seems different lately than she was before. According to Junpei-san, she is now able to smile clearly. A common saying is that someone seems complete, completely different than before. Could that have happened to her? Did someone switch our Fuka out for this new one? You've talked with Igus for a while. It seems he's done playing. Oh, Kodomaru-san, welcome back. Kodomaru-san would like to, you to give him a bath. Time to give him a bath. Alright. The 26th. Kenji. Hey, Kenji. Jeez, he's completely out of it. He should start drinking coffee before he comes to class. How about you, Femsi? Everyone knows that coffee is derived from Arabic. Or you should, because I told you that last time. But which of these things is not Arabic? Sugar, magazines, wristwatches. Uh, crap. I don't remember this one. Wristwatches. Bingo, you hit the jackpot. Both sugar and magazine have their origins in Arabic. However, they're derived from European languages, not directly from Arabic. You gave the correct answer. Cool. Good to know. Kind of forgot that one. Oh, you guys are new. Why are you still talking about exams? That's like past news. And you won't shut up about Akihiko. Alright, well it's Monday. Oh. Ooh. Ooh, I don't have a choice, do I? I love how my opinion of Akihiko just shot down. <laughs> Once he stopped hanging out with me, it's like, I'm done playing with you. I'm going to go talk to uh, Yukari now. Alright. Well, I might as well then. Kodomaru is almost maxed out. That is very nice. Let's do it then. Glad you're feeling better. Alright, let's go. Let's see what the holdup was. You wandered here with Akihiko. Seemed rather quiet today. Thanks for coming out today. Well, I was bored. <laughs> Happy to be with you. I... I see. Why are you so... He seems to be at a loss. He looks down at the ground. I if you don't mind, can I talk to you about something? <laughs> I don't mind at all. I haven't been able to get it all arranged in my own head, though. He slowly begins... Uh, speaking. I've told you a little before about Miki, my younger sister. 
who I couldn't save. I was the only person she had. There weren't any kids around her age at the orphanage. So she didn't have any friends. Okay, so they're not blood relatives. They He just calls her sister because they grew up in the orphanage. She'd always tag along after me and call me Big Bro all the time. Nanako mentioned? Akihiko bites down on his lip. Why did she have to die? She was so small. She never knew her parents' face, or have good food to eat, or got to have any toys. She had nothing. Isn't there some saying, like, about how being alive is a kind of sin? Akiko's lips are trembling. That's not true. Femsi. She's dead and gone. I understand that, and I've accepted it. But I can't do anything about that anger and sadness that I feel. I have to live with that for the rest of my life. Here's what I wanted to tell you. I thought I wanted you to help me bear that burden. I know that it's terrible for me to ask, of, uh, ask this of you. I'm sorry. He hides his face from you in his pain. Why did he tell you about this? You sense his faint affection towards you. It's what drives him too, though. To become strong. I might be seeing Miki in you. But if that's not what it is, then these feelings I have... Why don't we start heading back home? We should get back. Interesting. Hi, how was your day? Well, I did learn something new. They're not blood related. And Miki is Ken's mother. But damn. Shit, who's the father then? And on top of that, why? Like, why? Well, if anything, it probably wasn't planned too, but, huh. I wonder if we'll get elaboration on that. Well, just have to play it through. I can't. No, Ken's not here. This may sound like a strange question, but I have to ask it. Am I being helpful? You could do more. Then I will work harder. I want my mom and Shinji to be proud of me. You're damn right. Is it just me, or is Akiko-san different now? I agree. Instead of getting all depressed when Shinji was in critical condition, Akihiko got, got stronger. Shinji was amazing, but so is Akihiko now. I can't wait until I see them fight together again. Everyone's anxiety over Shinji has subsided. They seem to be cherishing their lives much more than they did before. His departure seems to have helped everyone grow and mature. Ya yeah, damn right. Alright. The internet isn't just for information anymore. It's become an important tool for communication. Every day, all around the world, people are making new friends and keeping in touch with old ones. Please remember that the next time you go online. I haven't been online since, uh, since the mail route with Maya. As you know, the next operation will be our last. Are you feeling nervous? Of course. Very nervous. There are two ways to prepare for battle. The first way is to get all stressed out thinking about it. The second is to turn your nervousness into energy for training. I choose the second one. I'm all about training. The more you train, the stronger you get. The stronger you are, the better your chances of winning. You're damn right. Yes. That's good. The next battle will be our last. Let's do our best. So I better save my game before I do my best. That's what. Uh, Monday, Monday, Monday. Bed. Head to bed. And I need to fucking go to the faculty office again, too. God damn, I keep forgetting. <laughs> They're popping up all over, aren't they? The people with apathy syndrome? Yeah, they are. My friend's brother's friend is one, too. It's starting to be a serious problem. I'm on the news every day now. Oh, and did you see the special program they ran? Nostradamus actually predicted all of this. Nostradamus. Oh, that's that anthropologist, right? Junpei, cool. It's kind of the guy I want to hear. 
All right. Well, I look at you guys all ready to go. One moment. Mr. Takenozuka, the physics teacher, is here muttering to himself. I should get going, but there's no time to waste. If I power walk to the station, it'll take seven minutes. But if I consider the speed the train pulls into the station, three minutes might not be enough. Oh yeah, I'm in charge of dinner tonight, so that's another 12 minutes to getting groceries. I'd rather compensate for the pressure ratio when mashing potatoes to avoid inefficiency. If an average potato's diameter is about 12 centimeters, then that comes out to... Ah, oh, forget it. Going home isn't worth the bother. I'm staying at school. Oh, it's you, Femsi. And do you want to stay the night at school, too? You're looking for Mr. Ono. Now that you mention it, I haven't seen that helmet lately. I mean that teacher. I don't have time to fritter away looking for him either, so try again later. You know, that helm of his is really a nice piece. I never say so to Mr. Ono's face because I never hear the end of it, but it's fine craftsmanship. The curved line at the top. It's an ideal arc for absorbing impact. An arc like that can absorb about 48% of the impact from above. Then, there's the material. It's not just a thick chunk of metal. It's extremely thin metal, in fact, layered with finely braided hemp for added practicality. His lecture goes on and on. Isn't that a wonderful specimen? Hmm, it's origin. I wouldn't know anything about that. Archaeological details don't interest me. You learned about the construction of ancient helms. Okay, maybe he's here tomorrow. Back to the class. Alright, Junpei or Yukari? Decision of the century. You know what? Since Tuesdays... I think on Tuesdays, Yukari is also available. But Junpei is only on these days. Let's finish Junpei first. Yeah. When you look closely, you can see a bruise under Junpei's eye. Uh, did you notice? Don't stare at it so much. It's just a pinch. Did you get into a fight? Uh, well, who cares? Don't bother asking, okay? It's really lame. I don't want to say it. Junpei scratches his head. Well, in any case, I don't think there's going to be any more photos of you going around. Thank you. Huh? Uh, um, haha. <laughs> Junpei's face is bright red. I think this is my first time. First time getting punched? Haha, <laughs> I've been punched way too many times before. He shrugs. I thought that if I laughed my way out of everything, I'd never be in trouble. That's why I try to avoid having to be serious when I, whenever I can. You know those times when everyone sits around and talks seriously? I really don't like those, so I'll goof around. I thought I could breeze my way through things and try to be fun. It's so much easier than having to do stuff like understanding each other. But after meeting you and the others, I've changed a little. Not everything about everyone's cool, right? Everyone has parts of them that, they're, that are cool or lame. But they're all doing what's best for themselves. After seeing you all like that, I think I got scared. There's no way you can understand each other unless you say what you think. Staying quiet and trying to act cool won't tell anyone, anybody anything. Seeing someone way smaller than me put everything they have into something and made me ashamed of myself. I never tried my hardest in anything. I don't take anything seriously. That's why I never gained anything and why I'm never happy. I realize that I'm not living my life at all. That's not true. <laughs> Thanks. When I get back those pictures of you, it crossed my mind. In the end, I just wanted you to trust in me. Like if someone like you could trust me, then I might be worth something. But trying to get you to rely on me to solve this is just wrong. You're an important friend of mine, after all. He laughs, embarrassingly. You sense that he trusts you. Damn. I'm so glad I got to see this. Brings a new, a new side to Junpei. It sucks that this place doesn't have any swings. Don't you sometimes just get the urge to swing once in a while? I used to ride swings a lot when I was a kid. I'd get close to the sky and think that I could go somewhere else. Somewhere that isn't here. That's what I'd think about when I was on a swing. 
Let's ride on one together sometime. You know how to get two people on one swing, right? One stands, the other sits. That's incredibly dangerous. <laughs> you and Junpei spend some time talking about all kinds of things. If we really do that, someone might actually end up very far from here. And by that, I mean another world because that's a concussion or a broken neck. But I like that, though. Never being serious because you don't want to, uh, you don't want to be involved uh, with like with people that way. So by not taking anything seriously, you don't hurt anybody, but you also don't gain any anything meaningful. I understand that. The cultural anthropologists have announced more info. Uh, one of them has accurately guessed the dates of recoveries and relapses in the past, but he believes that the next wave of recovery will be on the seventh. All right. Wait, why am I saving again? I don't need to save. I'm good now. Ken, let's do it. Oh, we're back here, huh? This is delicious, Femsi. You and Ken chatted over a meal. No! He didn't go up. He didn't go up. Well, at least I know he doesn't auto-level now. It's all your fault. Pharos, it's your fault. I had to cut my dinner with Ken early because you were going to, <laughs> you were going to visit me. It'll be a full moon again in just another week. At last, the twelfth one. Are you ready? Regardless of how long it's been, a lot has happened, hasn't it? But it's a bit soon to be reminiscing. How about I come see you once it's over? Be careful now. Pharos disappeared. Well, he isn't wrong. He will visit me. Six days, huh? I better really get, get onto that faculty office stuff, because if that doesn't, I'm going to miss out on it. Alright, who's next? Mr. Terochi, the Japanese teacher, is here muttering to herself. Ododoita, how did it get so late already? My darling's not home today, and I'm so samishi. Hmm, maybe I should go to dinner with Miss Toriyumi. That restaurant with the interesting game. What was it? A mahjong parlor? I hope I don't lose again, but I don't think I can win at all against Miss Toriyumi. Konnichiwa, Femsi. How are you? Miss Toriyumi isn't here. I was just looking for her myself, actually. Say, Femsi, do you play mahjong? Not in this game. It's very omoshiroi. The technical terms in particular are so interesting. If I play too much, I can't get them out of my head for days. Mentan, Pin, Dora Dora, Richi Ipats, Chitoitsu, Tsumo, uh, Mangan, that's my favorite one, or Yakuman. I've said the stuff even in my sleep. My poor darling hasn't slept very well as a result. Shall I teach you the other technical terms? I'm just repeating what Miss Toriyumi taught me, but, well, for beginners, there's only Richi. There's a few intermediate phrases. I gotta reverse a Dora. Looks like you're waiting for one tile, or you, you've you gotta have more than two Han. Ooh, or advanced stuff. You don't have a hand, do you? I have all the tiles you're waiting for, and Mangan Buya. So far, I've only had chances to use the beginner phrases, though. But Miss Toriyumi is a very patient teacher. She'll tell me, you should throw this one away, or... You won't get many points if you call that one, so I wouldn't. And I dropped that tile by accident, so you can't don't it. She's taught me so much, but I haven't been able to win a single match. Okay, that last one just sounds like cheating. Uh, you learn technical terms for mahjong. <laughs> Players who haven't, people who don't know what mahjong is, did not understand a lick of that conversation. <laughs> and I don't blame you. All right, who is out today? Is Yukari? Damn it, no one's here on Wednesdays anymore. That is depressing. Rank 9 though, rank 7. This may be a good time though to get a fortune for Junpei, which will ensure that he ranks up the last time I get him. Just to be safe. There we go. Oh, is Junpei and Yukari going to walk him? Do you think Korochan knows that this next operation will be our last? 
I think so. So do I. Kodochan has animal instincts. And you? Kodomaru is freaking awesome, dude. He's not afraid of battling shadows, even though he's so small. I'm taking out the next shadow for Kodomaru. Well, what about oh, Ikutsuki's here? The team's morale seems to be high. Yes, yes, that's very good. I'll be looking forward to celebrating your victory. And I guess... He will avenge the death of his owner in the next operation. I believe it. We haven't been going to Tartarus much lately. You should have a better strength training regiment. We don't want to have any regrets, so train as much as you can. Oh wow, he knows we aren't going in that much. I see. Cease will probably be disbanded after the final battle. I have so many memories of my time in Cease. Good ones, bad ones. What about you? Did you enjoy it? Yeah. I hope you will always remember the good times we shared together. Yep. But we're not going in just yet. Just in case Theo, Theo's ass calls me one last time. Oh nice, he will rank up. Yes. Yeah, yes. He's frolicking happily. He picked something up. No. No, no, it wasn't a rank up. I was baited. Fuck. Oh, it's you. Uh, well. Out with it. So, uh, if you're free, let's go get some ramen. Oh, yeah. That means Junpei will rank up. And he's done. The next chapter is about enzymes. Are you worried? It'll, I'll go over. It'll go over your head. Don't worry. You're already familiar with the main places enzymes can be found. Your own body. Let's see if you can tell the class. Fem C. Considering milk, which contains lactic acid. One type of enzyme function is to break lactic acid into glucose and galactose. What is that enzyme called? Lactase. Yep, you got it. Some people get stomach aches from drinking milk because their bodies can't produce enough lactase. The same thing happens for some people in alcohol. If they lack enzymes to break down, break the alcohol down. But if you're wondering if you have that particular enzyme, don't try to find out until you're 21, okay? You gave the correct answer. Nice. Alright, Junpei. Yeah, let's just jump straight into it. No, let's not actually. Let's head to the faculty office and do this. Shit. There he is. Ah, FMC, I've been waiting for you. Okay, not really. I've looked and looked, but there's nothing at my house that's not related to Masamune. That didn't belong this didn't belong to Masamune personally, but it still has ties to him, so Do you really need this? Maybe you've reconsidered. Not that I'm reluctant at all to give it to you, you understand. So I'll give it to you, but... But... You'll take good care of it, right? It'll become a family heirloom, right? Obtain Kanetsugu's helm. You must be proud, Femsi. You've got a family heirloom now. Yeah, I guess this is how it should be. Well, I've still got a few of those left at home. This is the second time I've given my helm to a student after all. <laughs> that Bebe. Do you know him? He's an exchange student in my class. Back in the spring when he first came here, he admired it so much that I let him have it. It does my heart good to see men with a samurai spirit, even those from a foreign country. It must be because the lives of the Sengoku generals still shine brightly across history. Masamune Date, for example. The amazing thing about him is that he... You enjoyed the stories about Masamune again. Alright, cool. Got the helm. And we're going to head swiftly back to the Velvet Room, so I can turn that in. Alright, Theo. I know, you got people lost. I do too. It seems you've completed a task. Here it is. This is the helm of the Sengoku Eda. The heft, the feeling of it, the character love on the brow. In other words, the act of wearing it proves the love one has for, the one, for one's own head. I see that this helm embodies a sense of love and respect for the wearer's skull. It's very interesting. Well, don't you take the helm with you. I'm not sure I can profess such a deep love for my own cranium. Please take this. Knee-high maid. Is there anything else I can assist you with? 
No, unless there's something new. Nope, just this. Okay, cool. We're done here. Yeah. No, back to school. I was like, wait, yeah, this is a school day. <laughs> God. I'm waiting for my boyfriend. I'm going to the drugstore and pulling them all to buy some skincare products. I don't want my skin to age prematurely. Okay, have you tried plastic surgery? No. Get some Botox. <laughs> Botox when you're in high school? Imagine. Alright, Junpei, let's finish you off. You on your way home? Can I talk to you about something? He looks very serious. Let's go. I'm in, okay. So, um... Oh, it's voiced. <laughs> I'm no good at this. Uh, where do I start? You better not be confessing to me, okay? We're literally about to get to the Chidori scene. Like this, this can't happen, all right? <laughs> you can't, you can't say some shit like "I love you" and then we get to the Chidori scene. Gonna confess your love? What? No. Well, I had something serious to talk about. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't think uh, Junpei would be romanceable because it would completely break the Chidori plotline, which is kind of insensitive. I want you to have this. I never had much I was that attached to, but I always held on to this for some reason. You obtained pig key holder. I used to keep my house keys on that. Thing is, I never wanted to go home. So when it turned out I was going to get to live at the dorm, you wouldn't believe how happy I was. Right. I thought after that, I, I could turn my back on it all. But after a while, I Whoops. didn't like the way I was trying to avoid stuff. So I kept this keychain and house key stashed away, since I figured I'd never have to use them again. But after a while, I, I didn't like the way I was trying to avoid stuff. I knew the problem wasn't going to go away just because I wouldn't look at it. And that I was lame for ever thinking so. That's why I dug these out. I plan to go see my dad, too. Then again, <laughs> I'm still kind of chicken. If you hold on to those for me, it'll be like you've got my back for it. That way, I have the guts to see him. Junpei's hands are trembling. You can tell that it took all the courage he had to tell you this. Hey, listen. You can talk to me too if anything's bothering you, alright? And I'm not saying so because I want to be the guy people turn to. It's just you don't have to do everything yourself. You and the rest of the gang were there for me, and I'm here for you the same way. Don't forget that, okay? You sense strong affection from Junpei. Wait, what? Did I say it twice? Also, this is probably the best way to end... Like, I always never really liked the the forced romance in the male route. I am so glad Junpei's uh, social link ends like this. Perfect. I was like, if they, if they, I was going to comment if they made this to a romance thing at the end, how disappointing it is. But right here, this is the perfect way to end Junpei's link. Absolutely amazing. We learn a new side about him. He's going to confront his past with his dad and he shows us that he's vulnerable. Excellent. Absolutely brilliant. Good shit. Okay, now you can play the angelic music. Cert, right. It's pretty funny, because uh, Kenji took us here, too. Alright. You know, I'm glad I got this power. And it's not because it makes me kind of like a superhero or anything. It always bugged me, that weakness I knew was there inside. But I feel like I can change. And I think that if it wasn't for you and the rest, I wouldn't have that feeling, even with this power. Or worse, I might have done the wrong things with it. So, thanks. <laughs> Jeez, listen to me going on like that. Come on, let's eat. You want some more green onion barbecued pork? Damn, and we spent a long time talking about all sorts of things. What a great way to Hello? end Junpei's Link. 
Save it for the look back, Umbra. Save it for the look back. The next full moon will be on the November 3rd. That gives us five more days. Five more days indeed. Okay, Kodomaru. Okay. If if I hang out with you, will you rank... God, I don't know. Oh my god. Well, I mean, okay, Kodomaru is rank 9, right? Yeah. And Ken is at rank 7. So basically, I should keep him at 9, because in case there's a day where he's available, but Ken isn't, right? So like, you, you get what I'm saying. So keep my options available. Alright. Actually... Alright, let's do it. Unless Ken doesn't rank up again. You piece of shit, he didn't rank up again, this fucking guy, I swear, oh my god. Alright. And more people in Tartarus, got it. I'm sorry, Kodomaru, I will never disrespect you again. I'll stay awake. Listen to that yapping, it keeps going. Yukari. Yeah, yeah, we're doing Yukari. Because um, Akihiko forfeited his uh, his spot. We are now doing Yukari. Hey, let's go. Unless she doesn't rank up either. Nope, think she will. Wait, no, she doesn't either. God, <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> no one's ranking up. Okay, well, since I got a call from Theo, I can head to Tartarus then. Yeah. It's four days, and Theo literally just called me, so he's not going to call me again. Unless he's like, actually, um, actually, Umbra, a uh, FMC, uh, a couple, a couple stray cats wandered into Tartarus. They're on the highest floor. I need you to head there immediately. What the fuck? Alright, let's bring... I haven't brought, I haven't brought Igus in a while. Igus, Akihiko... <laughs> And Junpei. Right. We're bringing the guys and the gals. Alright, let's head up. Another time for another Tartarus session. Oh, it's a shame. I have nothing to talk about, actually. That's crazy. Because I don't prep anything to talk about. I guess let's change your outfit first. You don't need to you don't need to wear that any longer. Instead. You can now wear your sky dress, the best outfit. All right, let us proceed. Well, get going. You know what? Since we're not even going to be fighting a lot, let's listen to the funky music. There we go. Let's change it up this time. All right. Make it to the top, and we're all good. Please spread out and search the area. Oh wait, what? Oh no, they're approaching me there now. Enemies. That's careful. not good. That is not good at all. I don't even know what they're weak to. Give me a sec. Let's see what you're weak to, though. Die. You. Two more enemies. The analysis failed. Yeah, I guess so. I killed it. Strike attacks ineffective. No strike. Oh my god. They do so much damage. I've been waiting for this. Okay, now I forgot my party's low level, so overall, that's gonna bring it down. Aw, cut it off when the song was about to get it get really good. And then she goes, it's demolition. Wiping all out. It's a badass song. I don't think anything will hit harder though than mass destruction. Like mass destruction is just something else. Okay, not bad though. You found the stairs Please before we had to fight another shadow. But damn, really? I can't believe we need to fight the damn shadows. It, Fucking Junpei. Oh. Well, right. ugh. I'll help Junpei. There are three enemies. Be careful. Ha. Wow, nice move. Nice try. One damage. Okay, kill you. 
I should really get my multi-skill persona. Okay, next guy I, uh, I rescue, I'm getting my multi-skill persona. I think it's Thanatos. Is it? No, that's my physical. Yeah. Whatever. Most of my bonds are complete now, so I can afford to get that stuff. Oh my god, Junpei is about to get a 4 times XP. Look at that. Beautiful. You could use that. Kale Rush. Nice. Oh wait, the stairs was already found, okay. You know what guys, regroup, I don't want you Everybody, please running- regroup. Oh my god. Nah, man. Alright, let's, let's deal with this quickly. There oh, they're all weak to lightning, though. Yeah. I've been waiting for this. Okay, now. I don't reckon you having that good accuracy back in uh, back in the first playthrough, Akihiko. Did something change? Okay, we're good. Ew, no. Fuck. Stop giving me ugly personas. Aracunda, oh god. We're gonna be fighting enemies now, so I'm gonna have to see all these level up screens. Just bear with it. Here is what I collected. Oh, thanks, I guess. Wait, what? Where is the exit? This way, okay. Here it is. Well, this Tartarus might take up more time than I thought then. I know I might not be able to yap if I wanted to. Okay. And search the area. No choice. Oh wait, these guys are, are physical. Yeah, die. Awesome. If you get into trouble, die. Okay. Just don't give me the persona, because that's more things I have to get rid of. Nice. Rakukaja. Sounds like a type of spice. Aha. Uh -huh. Nice try. 146, got it. Please spread out and search the area. I just want to rescue a guy so I can get out of here. Ah, <sighs> but damn, we're coming to the end of Persona 3 Portable at a very quick rate. Awesome. I'm gonna have trouble, to, I'm gonna have to check the next three games to put on my list to play. That's what I did basically when I started out. The first three games, when I started all the way back in December last year, was Persona 5 Royal, Judgment, and uh, God of War, I think. Yeah, and then I ended up completing God of War so way too quick, now. so I was like, oh shit, I need a game to play. So I was like, quick, Persona 3 Portable, because it was like a really cheap game, it was like 20 bucks or something. I was like, alright, cool, might as well play this now, since it's been a while since I played Persona. So, yeah, I'm gonna have to pick my next three games to put on my list. I like to spice up the gameplay though, so we played Hack and Slash in God of War, and then we Please played Turn Base the area. in, uh, whoa, whoa, oh shit, a rat, <laughs> okay, kill his ass. There are three enemies. Can't I, can't I just... Okay, yeah, there. That's what I thought. Think you can slap me? If you get into trouble, run! Love it. One more to go. That's my job. Do it. Alright. As I was saying... Oh, I might as well get the XP. Sure. There we go. Seven. That's decent, I guess. It'd be worth more if it was the, uh, we were on the higher floors. But yeah, I try to spice up, like, the gameplay loop. So, like, this is turn-based, so I'll probably pick another game that has action combat or, like, an open-world endness. Fuck. Can't walk, can't walk one second. Die. Die. There is no trouble. Ooh, another XP, though. No! Fuck, I didn't mean to. Now oh, whatever. But yeah, at least we're not having these uh, one hour to two, to two, or one to two episodes basically uh, dedicated to Tartarus because that's what it was last time in the Mail MC and I 
I do regret doing that, I would say. If there's one thing I regret in the male MC route, it's that uh, there was just way too much time in Tartarus I probably could have cut out because it was just too annoying. Because I didn't grind too naturally. This is a tough one. Watch each other's backs. Ain't no way you just said that. But alright. I might not be able to one-shot them, so let's see. Buff up, just in case. Okay. Junpei. Keep it going. That one just won't die. The enemies return to normal. That did decent damage. Okay. The enemy is still alive. Oh, you're gonna mind charge? Okay. Don't overdo it. No problemo, okay. Let's kill You're the you're the charged up one. I need you to cease to exist. Thank you. That one just won't die. That's okay. Because they can use items too. I'm killing uh, I don't know if it'll kill him. Try to shock him. Huh? Try that. Okay, it does 1296 though. It's all up to me. You think you stand a chance? Persona. This is what happens when you start NG plus and you don't level anyone. Ooh, good dodge, me. Good dodge. Super good. Burn. Wow, nice try. Nice you know what? Eat this. The enemy is getting stronger too. Look at me posing like a sassy queen while my entire team lies in front of me. Uh, okay, can I... There we go. Revive an ally... One, two, three. Okay. Good job, guys. Let's, uh, yeah, I'm gonna head back down real quick. Do I, don't I have the item? Where's the item? Uh, that lets me get out of here. I forgot what it's called now. Uh, dungeon escape. There it is. Just real quick, I'm gonna grab some personas. Where is it? I'll get yeah, I'll get rid of these pieces of shit. I don't need them. I can get rid of the moon, right? Yep, because she I'm done hanging out with Shinji now. Rest in peace, Shinji. Uh justice I still need for Ken. Strength is for Kodomaru. Priestess. Actually Priestess is done too. I can get rid of that. I'm done with Fuka. Hellel is Star, Akihiko, still need Temperance, Bebe eventually, Lover is Yukari, Emperor is Hidetoshi, Magician is done as well. So I can get rid of that. Cool, alright. I guess I can show you my other personas then in that case, finally. Allow me to show you my masterpiece of a... I can, yeah, I can get, I can get Orpheus too, why not? This is my main male Orpheus. And where is he? My other one. Thanatos. And I'll get my Messiah too. Why not? Sure. Might as well play around with my fun personas. That I totally didn't break the game in. Well, they're not optimal optimal, but I made them fun. Cool. I'm pretty broke now, aren't I? Because they cost a lot of money. Yep. I have three mil now only. <laughs> Alright. But now I have some multi skills, so that's good. You'll see what I mean eventually. I guess I'll play around with some other personas instead of Orpheus Telos. Let's go with Let's go with Thanatos. There. Messiah is just an almighty persona user. <laughs> 
or Persona. Yeah. I made him like an all-arounder, so he can just almighty wipe anything. Observe. There are three of them. Strike first. So they're weak to physical, right? Okay. So heavy to all. I summon you. Warpal blade. Yeah. There we go. I don't know, am I feeling great right now? I didn't check my status. So if I am, then yeah. That probably did a lot more damage. Anyways. I might as well take this time to beat everybody in my way. I could just explore alone, but... Might as well. Seeing them level up does put a smile to my face. It's like taking kids through a daycare. Nope, I'm only feeling good. Okay. So if I was feeling great, I'd probably have done like 3,000 to them. That's a lot of damage. Ooh, nice. I can walk right past you. We'll go this way. You found, you found the stairs already? Damn. Alright, there's someone here. Got it. Please spread out and search the area. Split up and defeat the enemy. All right. Okay. What's a person doing here? Come quick. I see. Everybody, please regroup. They're right by the stairs too. It's Michael. Look, see? She has the uh, the backpack. <laughs> Michael, it's me. She doesn't respond. All right, all right. No problem. Let's go. Yeah, it's pretty cool that you can see their actual sprites. But, uh, yeah, I think so far I'm, like, my highest... <sighs> okay, now you messed with me. I think you're weak to win. Oh my god, that damage. I don't think they're weak to... I don't think they're weak to physical. Oh, they are. Oh my god, that frame loss. I need to see that again. Jesus. By the way, that skill you can't get on uh, organically. I, I cheated that in. But uh, yeah. Ew, no. Stop. Stop picking up personas. I don't want them. Alright, cool. Why are you so big? That's a lot of you guys. Four dazed enemies. Now's the time. Take this. Thanatos. Okay, the male MC says it better. Thanatos. Do it again. All right. If that didn't work, Persona swap. Um, where is it? Where is he? Messiah. Time to drop the bomb. Drop it. Boom. Yep. That's the attack I used to get through the Monad levels in my first playthrough. Okay, I'll take that. Well, at least they're getting a level like every fight. But I don't think they need it really. I should have brought Ken actually because when Junpei gets his awakened persona, eh, it's not going to matter. Why are you guys all here? God damn it. Watch out. There are four enemies. Oh, right. I forgot I have this too. That's true. Give it a try. Persona! Forgot I had my light. Die. Enemy defeated. Last one. Pierce attacks have no effect. Persona! That won't work. Here's a chance. Let's get him. Get back here, you son of a Bro, it's one guy. Just slap him. Seven thousand, okay. So each party member adds about like two to three thousand or two point five. Good to know. All good. Yeah. 
healing wave. Okay, I can listen My to this. Persona learned a new ability. It restores your health a little when you advance to the next floor. Got it. Not that I need it because I have a victory cry. All right, let's go. Please spread out and search the area. Floor 150. The stairs are just there. No. There are three enemies. Be careful. Uh, this might work. Huh? Also, I shouldn't have this skill on this persona either. <laughs> it's exclusive to Alice, the death persona right before, right underneath Thanatos. All right. Cool, cool. This way. Please spread out and search the area. Damn, how f how high up is this place? 180? I have found something. I don't remember. Here it is. Medical powder. Thank you, I guess. There Someone on this floor. Got it. Please spread out and search the area. Here comes the what's a person doing here? Come quick. Damn it, why aren't they here? Where are they then? Must be this way. Thankfully, nobody has gone here yet. Yep, there they are. New. No. Aha. Uh -huh. You missed me. Alright, good. I think that's all the people, right? No, there's still someone missing. 158 to 163. Oh my god. 158 to 163. Wow, we got ways to go still. Jeez. Alright. We area. have at least 10 more floors. That means like around 15 floors, but yeah. Uh, 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 a chew. Three enemies. They all seem agitated. Are you sure you really wanted to do this? Persona. Thanatos. Hit him with it. The animation is sick. Alright. Done. But I think the game I'm leaning towards playing after this, uh, and I guess if we're counting after Skyrim too, because it's after this and all that. Oh no! Found something. I guess I have been detected. you are on your own for that. I'm sorry. I'm going to. I'm going to be doing something else. Looking, looking for the stairs. Sorry. You got this though, right? You're not too underleveled for this. Hopefully. Well, she's not dying, so I guess she's doing all right. There it is. There's the stairs. Oh, apparently she's done fighting. Okay, because they didn't. Please spread out and search the area. Fuka didn't tell me to leave her behind or anything. That's good. Oh God, I'll deal with you quickly. Watch out! There are four enemies. Take this. Spirit bomb. Enemy defeated. Now's our chance. And some of this. I summon you. What? Okay. I forgot. They don't take physical of any kind. Here's our Caesar. <laughs> Here's our Caesar. I've been waiting for this. Okay, now! Nice. Thank you, Akihiko. I did not want to swap again just to use lightning. Ew, no. Another persona. Gross. Good stuff. No. Don't need the access point. Damn it. This wasn't the way. Oh god, it's these guys. Be careful. Do they take physical? Good question. Oh, they do. Good. Hell yeah. Alright. We're all good. No, no, I, I, you don't have to give me a one more. You don't. 
Yeah. Wait, I can just exit it? Nice. Even better. 39 yen. What is this? Miku? Okay. A little Miku reference for you. Aw, oh, thanks. Says no one. Oh. Yeah, the, the game I'm Please thinking to do next area. is, uh... An enemy has located fucking hell, I guess. We're continuing. We're, leave, we're leaving people behind now. We are. Because, uh... I don't want to spend too much time in Tartarus since we've already gone through this. It's just the guys now. I have left Igus behind. But yeah, the game I'm thinking about playing next is Final Fantasy VII uh, Intergrade. That's the one. I really wanted to play that for a while too. So, that is there the goal. Three enemies. Be careful. Persona! Die. It'll probably happen. Yes. And I also hopefully will um, have some streams going too, which hopefully my uh, hopefully my computer doesn't crap out because that's one thing I'm a bit like I, I unknowing of how your back was turned to me. There was no way you knew. You couldn't know. You're not a spider. You don't or a fly. You don't have those capabilities. But yeah, so really big stuff. Well, not big stuff, I guess, but new stuff, I guess, coming in the summer. I'm very excited myself, personally. Because if it turns out great, cool, we got more stuff to do. If not, Please spread out and search the area. we're just going to do the same thing like we always do. That shadow, oh my god, really? For one guy? Okay, I see how it is. I'll be cheering you on from here. Good. This piece of shit ruined my entire mood. Look away from the cards, yes. Nice, I can just press B. I didn't know I could cancel shuffle time. That's just great. Hold on to this for now. Why are you glowing? Oh no. Yes, nice. Here, take this. More useless junk. Oh, oh, really? And you're gonna put the stairs right Please next to me? And search the area. I see how it is. There are three enemies. God Get damn out. it! Die! Enemy defeated. Oh, it deflected it. Okay. I couldn't finish it off. That won't work. Couldn't finish it off. Damn, no damage. Ew, you're, you're using that move? That move sucks. That's the Crescent Moon one. Ooh. Good hit. I'll take the XP, I guess, since they're here. Nice. Sukunda. At this rate, we'll end the game with uh, Fuka being the highest leveled, hey, come quick. Someone's here. highest leveled cease member. Alright, alright. It's another old lady. Come here, old lady. Let's get you back to uh, the Grandpa's Mansion. Grandpa's Mansion? What? What am I saying? Okay. If next Tartarus layer is like this, I'll probably just explore alone so I don't have to deal with all that. Although my team will suffer. Worst comes to worst, I'll give them the omnipotent orb during the last fight, so whatever, so they don't get one shot. Please spread out and search the area. But if anything, I'll hold on to this for now. they'll naturally power level in the last layer of Tartarus because that's when you get the XP cards that are like level 10, which just completely, which give you like 10k XP every time, so that'll be more enough, more than enough to keep them, keep them up there. You know what? We've had you guys for a while. I'm going to swap you guys out. Let's bring you Kadi in. Yeah. All right, Junpei, you're sitting out. All right, all right. 
Uh, Mitsuru, you're in. And, uh... Actually, no. Kodomaru. Yeah. There we go. I guess and Ken, you guys had a lot of spotlight during the male playthrough. So you know what? Let's uh, let's switch it up every now and then. Let's have the girls and girl's best friend. There we go. Its Arcana is strength. This won't be easy. Really? I beg to differ. Wait. Can I kill him? <laughs> Let's see. I don't think physical works on him. Let's see if it does. God damn that damage. Slash did damage though, okay. Eat this. Die. Good hit. Well, at least she heals. Good heal. Help me. Wait, what? Really, Kodomaru? You, you think that's gonna work? Alright, time to swap out. Um... Yeah. This is a time to use that. Orpheus. Good shit. Persona. All right, how about fire? Probably won't work. Let's try ice. I summon you. Do it. Oh my god. No shadows detected. I swear, mind charge is like the most busted <laughs> ability. Well, then again, I have magic ability up too. So for it, like the reason why my spells are do even more damage is because on top of mind charge, which doubles the magic damage, I also have spell master, so it's reduced its cost by half, and I have magic skill up, which means all these abilities, since they're single target, which already deal severe damage, they do even more damage because of this of the increased magic damage. So yeah. It's busted. And no, I didn't make them legit. This is all, like, it's all modded. But the game's not modded. So, yes, that's right. I am not, uh, I'm a beater. <laughs> but I'm not a beta tester. Okay, let's keep going. Please spread out and search the area. Oh, no, I'm sorry. Oh. I'm sorry. Okay. I didn't mean to interrupt your toilet time but since you choose to pursue me there are three enemies Be you'll give careful. me no other choice Thanatos do it uh, actually this one is better Persona! eliminate one enemy left. you stand in my way huh? then you get the fist nice Oh, I don't need the XP though. I, I really don't, like, it doesn't do anything for me. <laughs> My personas are max. Oh, I guess for... Yeah, I guess for Fuka though. Okay, cool. Let me try down here. There it is. Thanks. This area doesn't... Oh, nope. Found it right now. Do you guys have anything to say, by the way? We visited Tartarus so many times, and now it's on the verge of disappearing completely. It's very moving, but it's too early to rest easy just yet. I know I've said this many times, but don't let your guard down until the very end. It feels weird because I was just with you earlier. Wait, really? The next shadows are last. We're so going to own it. So let's pump ourselves up with experience here before that. That's right. That's what we do. 
now we're at the top. Lonely it is at the top, isn't it? Well, since we're here, I guess I might as well read all the documents so you guys have full context on uh, what is actually going on here. Whoops, no, here. Alright, so the first document. The electricity is hooked up, but why do they need so much? There's only a school on this island. Weird. Kirijo's Ergo Research Branch plans to build a lab on this island. I wonder what for. Three. They built a research facility here. They want me to join the team, but I have a bad feeling. Four. The team leader asked me himself. I was so surprised. It's the same man who once saved my life. Five. I wanted to be with him, so I joined. What a mistake. We shouldn't be experimenting with these shadows. Six. I knew it. These shadows arise due to human emotion. If I'm right, collecting them will... 7. I've heard it all. The plan is evil. But there's hope. If people could control the shadows inside them... If they could, then... Well, that's all for now. <laughs> Find out next time, sucker. Just kidding, I'm going to turn this in first, then we're done. It means you've completed exploring the fourth block of Tartarus. However, I feel your greatest challenge is yet to come. My master and I have watched your growth with great delight. I hope you will be alright. Please take this Megidolon gem. Nice. I do all that and you just give me a nuke. I very much appreciated if it was my first playthrough. 